Hey, my loves, it's your girl, Miss Muddy XX here. So, um, today marks 25 years um, since Moesha um, first premiered. And to me, um, when, when we think of black sitcoms, we always think about Cosby Show, Different World, Martin Living Single, Good Times, Fresh Prince of Bel Air, which all of those are great. Black sitcoms. I loved all of those. But one sitcom um, some people don't think about is Moesha. And for me, uh, Moesha was a um, game changer because Moesha, I saw so much of myself in Moesha growing up because she was a good girl who got good grades, tried, um, and but she dated the bad boys. And then the fact that the matter is, is that when I was growing up, there were not a lot of um, LGBTQ characters on TV. And there weren't that many black trans women. But here they had this tall, slim, brown-skinned girl with braids and um, as a lead. And when I saw that, I was like, oh, my gosh, somebody who reminds me of me. And just to, just to put the top on them, and, and then the fact that I was a Brandy fan from the moment um, she dropped I Want to Be Down. Um, and even before then, when she's on theater, I was just such a Brandy fan. And um, Moesha is one of the best black sitcoms, I don't care, um, ever. And it changed the game with style, fashion, just so many things. So I want to say um, to Brandy, happy 25th anniversary to Moesha and the entire cast. Moesha was a phenomenon because also remember this, another one of my great sitcoms I love was um, was Monique on the Parkers. The Parkers was a spinoff from Moesha. So without, Mo so without no Moesha, there would be no Parkers. And I love the Parkers, okay? So happy 25th anniversary to Moesha and Brandy and the entire crew. I love you, my loves. If you've not watched the sitcom, watch it. Promise you. You'll enjoy it. Bye.